Hello guys, welcome back to Good Share Tips. In this video, I'm going to talk about connectivity issues in OnePlus devices. The connectivity issue in the sense, both Bluetooth as well as the Wi-Fi. So, let's start with Bluetooth. Sometimes, when we are trying to connect to our friend's device, we will not be able to connect the Bluetooth. There might be some issues, and one among the issues in the most of the cases, the Bluetooth cache memory. So, in order to clear it, what you have to do is, go to Settings. Now, go for Apps and Notification and now you have to go for bluetooth and now clear the cache memories so in order to do that scroll down so here i can see the bluetooth now storage and cache and here there is one option clear storage now tape over here and clear it now try once again to get connected in some cases or the most of the cases this will be a solution and apart from this you can also go for reboot option so now after doing this if it's still finding an issue with the bluetooth i suggest go for reboot now the reboot option will be helping in most of the cases. Sometimes in a busy schedule we might be forgetting to update our apps. Maybe we, we might be a lot of busy such a way that even we forget this. So what you have to do is make sure all the apps in a device is up to date. Then even if you see in some cases what happens is make sure if the bluetooth is not fine or it's not working properly I suggest apart from one try with any other friend and check whether there is an issue with the device or your particular bluetooth. So try this and there might be chances. Sometimes you might be doing the Bluetooth or we might be using the Bluetooth frequently. So this will be having a lot of list. I mean the histories will be large. So sometimes this might cause the Bluetooth not to work. So in order to do that, I mean in order to clear that, to sort this issue, what you have to do is open the Bluetooth. Now go for previously connected devices. Now as you can see, I'm going for C-Odd. So these are the previously connected device in my OnePlus device. So what I'm going to hear there is a settings option click over here and now go for forget now go for forget device the same way do for the rest forget device now once again try to connect this will help in most of the cases sometimes we will not be able to connect even after trying all these things and you still figure out what is the real issue but i'll tell you this is a very simple thing which you have to do what you have to do is now my bluetooth is on now let me off it now wait for a few seconds hardly around 10 seconds i must say wait for 10 seconds now re-on it, I mean on it, then go for any kind of connections to any other devices. This might help, there is a chance for this. This is the most issue which happens in most of the cases and most people are not so much aware of this. In most of the cases, in every single person, you can see the power saving mode will be enabled. So now if you do this and you go for to connect your Bluetooth to any other devices, this won't work. There is a very high chance this won't work. So in order to make sure, always turn off power saving mode when the bluetooth you are doing something with the bluetooth so make sure this one and keep in mind all the time this one so there is a very high chance due to the power saving mode you will not be able to connect the bluetooth so that's all about when it comes to bluetooth issues in the oneplus devices so now let's talk about the wi-fi issues so the very first thing always make sure the wi-fi router which is you are going to connect is fine it is in working condition Maybe if it is not in the working condition, there is no point talking about the Wi-Fi. So make sure these things are fine first. Now imagine the Wi-Fi router in your nearby your home or any other in offices or any other places is installed recently. So if it is installed recently, make sure all the wiring connections are proper as well as check whether the network status on the router is fine and also the most important one, do not connect multiple devices with it. So if you are doing all these things, there is a very high chance for the Wi-Fi issues. So make sure you are not doing this. So this is a, a very most common issues which is being seen in all the cases. Sometimes you open the Wi-Fi and you still can't figure out what's happening because you are not able to connect your Wi-Fi. So what? why this happens? Sometimes what happens, you know, some of your friends or your colleagues or anyone nearby, they might be changing the Wi-Fi password. And if you try with the old one, you are not going to get connected. So make sure or inquire yourself that whether the password is being changed. If you are trying to connect it once, one or twice or even thrice, if you still can't connect, check for the password and type it properly and there might be chances you will get connected. And the another one, the very most important thing is, sometimes there will be some kind of bandwidth which is given for your Wi-Fi. For example, 1 GB or 2 GB daily, some kind will be there. So in this situation, make sure if the particular bandwidth which is allocated for you is completely used up, then you are not going to get the Wi-Fi. So make sure the particular data pack which you have is not used up. So be alert on this. Sometimes what happens is we might be connecting to a particular router which is already been connected by many people. 
for example maybe more than 10 or what something we say so if this happens then you will not be able to connect to that particular router so i must suggest make sure there is should there should be a lean number of persons should connect to the wifi so if it is too heavy on that then you are not going to get connected to the wifi make sure the network service is been not been stopped by any kind of provider and if you still try the same you need to reconfigure the wifi router once if you if you can't configure it by yourself i suggest call an expert ask the suggestion from his side and do the necessary actions so that's all about when it comes to wifi and bluetooth in the oneplus devices so don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for further notification you can ask any kind of questions in the comment section we'll try to get back to you this is shahin signing off from get your tips